The Museum of Underwater Art off the coast of Townsville transformed into an underwater art studio over the weekend in a world first tourism experience. Artists put pen to paper 16 metres below the surface, a brand new way to experience our iconic Great Barrier Reef. 70 kilometres off the coast of Townsville, the Museum of Underwater Art has been enthralling divers for nearly three years, and now artists too. On board the Western Lady on Saturday, these keen marine Michelangelos took the plunge to discover, dive and draw. We'll be there in about three minutes. A world first tourism experience born out of a crazy idea and months of underwater experimentation between Adrenaline Dive and Umbrella Studio Contemporary Arts. I'm an artist and I'm a diver so having a site like the Museum of Underwater Art to dive on it just became something that I really wanted to do to draw here. 13 participants have made the two hour long trip here to John Brewer Reef, three diving for the very first time. They'll all be using special Teslin paper, perspex boards and graphite pencils to sketch the underwater museum from below. Certified divers going the full 16 metres to the sea floor, etching the wonders in front of them for 50 minutes. I was just on the outside of the atrium leaning on it more or less and then I, all I had to do was turn around the corner and we had our, our gardener with the shovel so that was, that was pretty cool. Inspired by structures natural and man-made. I'm already an artist and an art teacher and I'm a Reef Guardians teacher and um, this has combined two of my loves and I, I'm just... I'm overwhelmed by how beautiful um, nature has put on a show today. From the sculptures to the soft coral and the macro algae, um, but also being in an environment where everything is moving around you, it's quite um, challenging as an artist and a diver. Exploring a whole new world while letting creativity flare. There's no stress about, you know, getting lost or, um, you know, knowing where you are or navigating. So I'd highly recommend it for, yeah, for first time divers. After a well-earned sleep, the artists were back on dry land on Sunday, developing their works into full-sized art using their preferred medium, rounding out the immersive experience that we were also able to just, yeah, at the same time celebrate both our local environment and our arts community um, has been an incredible opportunity and we hope to do it again in the future. Hayden Manso, WIN News.